isso. stuff I did. And I just said just a couple of things that just might help a little bit. So you may have noticed a couple of scrapes there. You know why that is? I think, and it's often I, I think this always with players, too much rosin. You're actually getting stuck, you can see, you know? You're getting stuck on the string with that because what you were doing was right, but it, it just, it's just Kate, that bow is caked in rosin. And the other thing is, I think it, it would do you a lot of good to think carefully about, um, I'm being very critical now because he's worth it, um, about <laughs> uh, where you, exactly where you are here with the bow. Because when you are, are quite looking for a softer sound, you need to move further up. Further, move the bow further up here, yeah? And then when, uh, just try the very beginning again, the very opening. Now you can be further down there and get a bigger sound and try and use a bit more bow. A really bigger sound, you see? Yeah. Um, and just little things like that. So when you start the beautiful tune off, da -da 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 -da, try that. Okay, now do it once more. Don't, don't use maybe so much bow and come a little bit higher up, quieter. Atmosphere, you see? It's a very quick line. Thank you very, very much. Did you learn? I wish you all the very best. Good teacher. And, and now I think it's time to hear your brother. Don't go away, though. Don't go away. But um, let's see what time you've got to offer. Um, so, what are you doing? Tell us your name and what you're going to play. My name is Jensen Renhunger. <laughs> 
W.H. Squire was one of the very first performers of the Outcast Theatre. He made a recording of it, I think the second recording after Beatrice Harrison, and um, very good of his too. Completely different style to what you hear now. Um, but this is obviously completely irrelevant. Can you give us a dance rustique then, please? Sometimes I think you go too far up, so you, you don't make as much sound as you could. I tell you what I'd like to do, that bit in the middle. Oops. Oops. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that bit in the middle. You know where you, um, no, 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 where he's got the so, screen. So, yes. You know, this bit, this bit, um, that bit there. Just try that bit. Um, okay. Play that bit. Right. Now get right down there, there a bit, not not too far, about here. And now really use your your right arm. Really move that bow loud as you can. Play as loud as you can. Come on. 
Okay, that's good, that's good. Now try it again. Use your whole bow. You're, you're stopping like the bow's only going to there. Use the whole bow, okay? Really good, really good. And I'll tell you what I'm really impressed with, um, apart from the fact that he's obviously enjoying himself, is, um, <laughs> so we, um, is your intonation. It's really good. It's really well in tune. I think it's fantastic. Well done. I'm going to play with, with Josh in something, a little tiny little encore. Vivaldi Conchitas for two cellos, um, which is interesting because it's a full CD, but there was only...